Hi, I'm Bob Parsons. I'm a golf fanatic. Some people will also say I'm an equipment junkie. That started from me being a middle of the road handicapper, noticing that the right equipment would always make a big difference in my game. I would spend maybe $250,000, $300,000 a year on clubs. I hit every club that ever came out because I was looking for any edge to be a better golfer. Most of the improvements are, are gimmicks. Not all, but most of them. And these uh, golf equipment companies, they have certain price points they need to hit. They have certain margins they need to do. So that makes it very difficult for them to really have uh, clubs that are as good as they can absolutely be. And I developed certain ideas about what needed to be the case in order to have equipment that really performed. Then I had a friendship with Mike Nicolette and Mike and I decided one day our goal was to do the very finest equipment and the cost didn't matter. Just do it, use the best process, use the best materials, no limits at all, no cost limits, no time limits, and we could just use our ideas to design the very best club that we could. We had one constraint and that was performance. We spent a lot of time. We had many, many prototypes. We had a number of stumbles. We had a three wood that uh, when you hit it the first time, uh, man, that thing would go a mile. You hit it the second time, the face would collapse. So we made the only disposable three woods. <laughs> but eventually we got it right. And one day my engineers called me and said, Bob, we've had a breakthrough. And you know what? What a breakthrough it was. The secret sauce is this here. We injection mold inside a compartment and back of the face, thermoplastic elastomer is the technical term for it. And what this does is that reinforces the face and it sucks up vibrations and it gives it a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful feel. We use the very finest uh, process uh, so we don't cut any corners. That's our commitment. Our commitment is to do it right. And that's why when people hit that, they, they can't believe it. We created golf club that looks like a blade, plays like a cavity back, and has a sweet spot the size of Texas. Nobody makes golf clubs the way we do, period.